Hey everybody, welcome back to the Lo-Fi Podcast. I'm your host Frank, and you're listening to the best podcast on the internet. Because it's got Caleb, and it's got Rick, Woo! and we're going to talk about... San Diego Comic Con today. SDCCEC. Hashtag. That's a lot. No. That's a lot of C's. That's a lot of. That's too much. SDCC. It's too much to remember. It's basically a lot of Comic Con stuff. It's Comic Con. It's Comic It's the Comic Con. It's not everything Comic Con, because it's going to be us. I don't like everything. Like CW, don't care. Walking Dead, don't care. Who cares about CW and Walking Dead? Yeah. Who cares about Bad DC? Girl well, I, sucks. I, I, Supergirl sucks. Some CW stuff was good, but such uh, as what? Are you gonna say Flash and Arrow? Flash, that CW? yeah, yes. That's what I'm gonna say, Frank. <laughs> what, <I thought laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what was with the whole negative shit? What was that? Because <laughs> I, I associate CW with trash. <laughs> <laughs> Those are good shows, you piece of shit. I liked the first season. I may concur. Flash. I watch them. I mean, yeah, you just need to watch it. Yeah. No. The second season of Flash was also good, but what I got sick of was every episode, at least five times, they had to be like, "Barry, let me talk to you for a second. And they'd go to the room and they have like a heart to heart. It happened mm-hmm. like five times each episode for show. like twenty episodes. I'm like, dude, I'm sick of this. What are they it's having ridiculous. Heart to heart about? Barry will be Barry will be mad about something. So like Barry, can I talk to you for a second? It's like a serious moment, or he's sad about something. Barry, can I talk to you for a second? Uh, and then but it's like, dude, I'm sick of this crap. This scripted like not realistic show. It's already. I mean, I already know it's you know whatever. But still, yeah, yeah. It, it's so I, for me, it's so scripted. It doesn't what, seem like yeah, yeah. real what life. What kind of Flash show would you like to see? I would like to see a show that is like that. But less of the cheese and more, I don't know, actually, that's a good question. I don't know if Flash too well. Would, would you make it grittier? Would you no, make no, it... No, uh, no, no, no. I don't think it has to be. No, I like the tone of it. Like I said, I really like the first season. But I think it's just the, the jokiness gets a little old for me for a while. It's real CW-ish. Yeah, it's like real you think like story. real B-level, real, like, like just drama. But I do like, I, I mean, I liked stuff. the first season a lot. Again, it, it's nothing wrong with it. I think it's fine. It's just that I think my, my main problems are script-wise. My, uh, my... I don't mind it because, you know, I watch it, with, I watch it with Emma. And she's, what, 12, right? So all those like heart to heart moments and shit like that those are like lessons and shit yeah. and that's kind of like what you know comics were back in the day especially flash and barry allen you know it's like teaching kids and teaching people right from wrong teaching them how to do things character development you know or building in people so <clears throat> having my kid watch that i feel like you know that was pretty cool you know, I, I, that's something I can enjoy and watch with her. Is it's like, hey, it's cool. I get flashed up, like a... and I get like, oh yeah, baby. So basically, here's some lessons that you can also learn. What you're saying is, it's a nice family show. Yeah, no, that's true. That's I do I, like that. That's I do, what it's I was a nice saying. Family show. Yeah. But for you, it's like, oh well, now I don't have to teach her this lesson. She can like, it's well, no, basically it's more of like pass uh, it off. Basically, ex- expand like, on it. I don't feel like doing it. Let's watch the Flash. They'll explain yeah, it. No, it's more like they, they, <laughs> that's happening. It's like, oh, yeah, baby, after that episode, it's kind of like expand on it. Yeah, expand yeah. on that lesson or something no, no, like yeah. that. Totally, you know? totally. I, and I agree. It's, that's what I do like about it. It's a cool family show that the whole family can get involved in. Yeah. I just got sick of it. And that's why I like Arrow, too, because it, it, it has more, I guess, adult lessons in that one and that one's a bit more grittier and you know yeah cool and, and i shit. liked the first three seasons of arrow yeah no definitely arrow it. does take a dip it takes a dip it, 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 and i was kind of yeah it, here's my biggest problem here's my biggest problem with all the cw shows they're 24 episodes long and i hate that if they cut that in half it'd be such a there would be some more solid shows and i'd watch all the seasons yeah, how's that? But since they're so long and they're 40 minutes each i'm like dude i well, can't me here is i i also feel like you can't really watch a show like that and feel very, like, captivated too much. Because a lot of people now second screen shit all the time, yeah, right? it's true. I mean, my kid's always on the phone when we're watching. Sometimes I'll be on the phone too. But, you know, it's kind of there and then the the moments happen and then you pay attention more or whatever. So it's, it's also good for that little, like, background shit, you know? Okay. When you want it. 
Because that was going to be my thing, because I don't watch those CW shows. And I feel like 24 episodes, when you say that to me, I'm like, dude, like how much padding and filler and side yeah, eight, like, of, like yeah. story B, mm-hmm. story C, before you even get back to the main arc happening the entire show. I feel yeah, like yeah. No, I this feel is like definitely you're, not something that you want to sit down and like, you know. Yeah. Oh, that's what I was absorb. doing. Absorb. Yeah, that's no, what yeah, I was yeah, doing. No, no, and okay. I was sitting there watching the whole show. You're and getting I was like, your okay, full attention. Yeah, like, no. I was like, okay. I got you. That's yeah. why I got sick of it. CW yeah. shows, second screen. No, yeah, yeah, definitely. I, I, I wouldn't put him in that category. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So that's, cool, cool. you know, now you understand me a bit better, and I hope you feel better too. Yeah. Uh, that's our now show that today. you learned that lesson, <laughs> <laughs> the more you know. Uh, <laughs> Watch CW shows with a second screen. <laughs> are y'all ready for some San Diego headlines? Headlines! <laughs> with an asterisk of things we only care about. More yeah. or less. Yeah. That's true. <laughs> because there's like a million things. We can't cover everything, nor do I want right. to cover everything. That's true. Right. I hope and I'm going to waste secondly, my... Because like, yeah. most show. of the CW shit is shit. Right? <laughs> you know. Yeah. And yeah. So, As someone who watches, I appreciate you always being honest about it. So. Yeah. yeah. I appreciate you. Yeah, awesome. appreciate you, man. Thanks, man. Cool. All right. So, Caleb, so first thing that's important got, with the headlines. This isn't so much San Diego, but you know, this is important to go over is uh, the new Cats trailer. Oh <laughs> shit! Did y'all watch that? I still do. Didn't no, watch I did it. Not. Didn't watch it. I watched but it. But I did see that picture and <laughs> just in that one photo. I, what the? Fuck? I didn't think it was the worst thing I've ever seen, but I was definitely like, "This is interestingly weird." It was. I mean, it's. I never seen the musical, but uh, Same. yeah. I uh, was watching the trailer. I'm like, this is so weird. I, I like, I can't take my eyes off it. Like, it's not good, but it's not horrible. In my in my eyes, it's just like I can't stop watching it. It's so this, strange. This just happened to come out while San Diego Comic Con was happening, or was this like a San Diego Comic Con thing that happened? I think the first one. Okay. Uh, I could be wrong, but I think it's the first one. Okay. I don't think there was a specific panel for this. Yeah, because I just thought that was uh, kind of weird for them to do that during a Comic Con. Yeah, or so I think for one, it would be it's going to be good for your type of people, mm-hmm. which is the furries. Yeah, uh, you're going to yes. really like it. Yes, because you see those cats in their full <laughs> yeah. like body. You're right. like, oh right. man, Frank's going to like this. I that was my first thought while watching did. it. I was like, Frank's going to like I can, like I can already imagine. Already. Yes, yeah. man. Frank's going to yeah. love this second like, shit. So that's, that photo. that's our two cents. And that was uh, sponsored. <laughs> that was uh, brought to you by Elisa. Oh, uh, yes. Who's not Elisa, here at the moment. Elisa, who's not with us today. No, she's fine. She's fine. So, she's she's fine. at home. She's yeah. doing stuff, being, probably. Being cool. Uh, so, yeah, that's the only reason why we covered that. Otherwise, I don't care. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm going to go to a small... Okay. To big. I like that. In my opinion. I like okay. that. Okay. okay. In my these. opinion. Okay. 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 These. All right. You just. You just. So. Told, you told thing, Elisa the cats was this small team. <laughs> <laughs> so first thing, Batman Beyond got a got a. Um, wow, I lost my words. <laughs> what did they just do to the animated um, series? They. Uh, live action. Re- no, no, they re- re- not re- reimagined. Remastered. Remastered it. Oh, yes, remastered. they made it look better. Yeah, yeah. yeah okay, remastered. Doing yeah, the same yeah. thing to Batman Beyond. We're releasing the whole series on Blu-ray, remastered. It looks a lot smoother. It looks a lot brighter because so they did a, like that. Is that the one? Vig- that's the one where you had the red bat suit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. Right? Okay. And Batman's old. I remember like seeing cane. some episodes yeah. of that when I was younger, for sure. And yeah. Batman's in the wheelchair. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. No, he's, he's, he's got like a old. cane. Oh, he fights it, people with this cane. Oh yeah, he's in the wheelchair too. Right? Wait, he's older. I forget about the wheelchair part. Because that's after like Bane breaks his back, right? And that's why he needs. That's why he needs him because he's like all fucked up or something. No, he's just old. That was the only reason. It was just he's old, and then he gets him as an oh, apprentice. Oh man, I'm gonna have an angry glasses man at me. <laughs> angry glasses coming at man. me because I'm getting this wrong. I'm sorry, I uh, fucked it up. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so they're really re-releasing the whole cool. series. It looks cool. It's gonna screams. be like a hundred bucks. Uh, whole big Blu-ray. Bucks, but it's a whole Blu-ray season. You know, okay. it comes with the little. If it's like everything in one. Yeah, it, it looks cool. I'm sure. I mean, I that would maybe like pay that for the first of uh, that the awesome the first like, animated, animated series. series. Yeah, yeah, the animated series, which was. Did you see it remastered? Uh, no. It's cool because like you see the the original footage and it's like kind of like choppy when it like pans up. Oh, like stuff was happening. So and they smoothed it out. Yeah, so they smoothed it out. So it's an actual smooth. Cool. It looks cool. And then cool. the the beyond they did a. They showed a scene and they cut it in half with like the old and the new, and the new is brighter. Yeah. And at first I was thinking like, oh, but I like it when it's dark. But like, no, the brighter looks nice because you can see things more clearly. Yeah, like so, the contrast is it lets you see more. Yeah. So I that's never watched Batman Beyond to be honest. Yeah, so that's what I'm saying. Like I remember like seeing parts of it. I just I never watched the whole thing through and through. Obviously, I mean we were 
if you think about it, back then we were kids with fucking VCRs. Like there was no DVR. You know, and we, our parents were going to be yeah. buying us those things. Like I mean, we what we watched was we, whatever yeah. our parents bought us on fucking VHS or something. You know what I mean? But back then, that was coming out when what VHS and maybe DVD transition was happening. Uh, in so which so case, uh, like you know, early two thousands. Yeah, yeah, it's like was there a box set of that? Probably not. You know, so I think that's why our memory of that stuff is a little fuzzy because there kind of wasn't a time for that. You know, sounds a bit judgy to me. <laughs> I'm judgy about how we grew up. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> I don't associate with Frank's upbringing. And <laughs> my I just mean why it was hard to different. watch stuff back then. Well, I watched it, Frank. Okay, it was on TV. <laughs> I don't know how hard that is. It's I mean, I, 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 I didn't watch that? it <laughs> just because I just, it didn't interest me. I, I watched school? the animated like, one. I like that when one. When you graduated, that. like three years ago. That was, we're fucking old. It was on Cartoon Network. Man. I graduated. It came like, out. I remember when it came out. I just didn't watch it. I chose not to watch saying. it. We didn't watch it. We fucking chose not to we're watch old. it. Okay, we're I'm old. just saying. Right? All right. Fucking I don't know why you bring it up. Fucking VHSs, man. I mean, uh, dude, that was no, out of my like, way. Why are you hitting on the VHS? Like, shit, dude. <laughs> It was a good show, though. Just Back in my day, when VHS was out, and, you know, was, I was confused. Was the DVD was, was coming out. Baby. The DVD yeah. and the VHS, yeah. I don't know what to do. Like, the blue I, I only yeah, had never-ending stories. That's all I had. That's all I watched, okay? <laughs> my parents didn't buy me stuff. That's but, what, uh, that's what we watched. <sighs> Hollywood yeah, video. Yeah. only had so much at Hollywood video. I, I only watched top video. <laughs> I went and rented games and I watched a movie. That was it. <laughs> Got my Mountain Dew. I was happy. There was no Mountain Dew back then. <laughs> there was. There was. There was. Oh, God. Yeah. So, I hate you all so much. Uh, <laughs> moving on. Moving on to another Batman related universe. Oh, okay. The Harley Quinn show. Oh. On the DC Universe app, which I oh. didn't buy because don't okay. care. Not gonna oh, watch that. I, I saw the trailer. I mean, and it, I, I liked it. I thought it looked fucking c- cool. I thought it looked uh, you cutesy. Think, you didn't think they were pandering to a certain audience? They were doing Which fucking audience? backpack dance, like Fortnite kids. Oh. Yeah, they're doing backpack dance type shit. I mean, and I was like, I didn't see that. I, I would sworn, say it's I know she did that. It's for definitely sure. geared towards teenagers. Yeah. But like older teenagers. Yeah. I they think curse like and stuff? Yeah. like teens. Yeah. Of but today, like I would say teens. older teens. Because they curse and stuff, and like it looks pretty violent too. Like, yeah. I mean, my my ten year old curses a storm. So, I would say it's, it's I'd four say most older ten year olds right now curse up I would more say than that show it's does. Four older teens, but I'm yeah. sure. Yeah, that's would, the audience. It's that's, geared that's towards. Their, yeah. It depends on who watches it, right? You yeah. know, you probably watched. You know, you probably watched. Uh, what RoboCop when you were twenty, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, I did. So. Well, no, I was younger. <laughs> Not that uh, old, Caleb. <laughs> uh, no, but yeah. So yeah, I think it's geared towards older teens. I liked it. I didn't think because the animation I thought like, was going to be toward geared towards the younger Adults. kids. Oh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You want to finish my sentence too? <laughs> <laughs> it looked like it was geared towards kids. Okay. And when I when it was actually a contrast, I was like, oh, that's pretty cool. And yeah. I like because uh, I read, I own most of the Harley comics that are going on right now. The run that's going on. There's been 64. I have almost all of them. All nice. of them? Yeah. Is the series that good? Yeah, it's pretty cool. And I'm a Harley Quinn fan. I, I feel like I was a Harley Quinn fan before it became like a big thing, you know, before oh, yeah, yeah. Suicide Squad and all that yeah, yeah. big thing. Like, same. Just in general, liked her. Yeah, cool. I just really liked her. Yeah. Like, well, because of the I animated loved series. Since, I, like, loved I loved her, her character. Series, yeah, exa- yeah. That, exactly. Yeah. So She gave me a, a couple boners back in the day. Oh, That's great. Right on, right on, <laughs> right on. Uh, so yeah, I, I thought it was cool. It's going along more of the recent comic run of Harley and there's some characters I recognize from the comics that I'm reading right now. So I liked it. I thought it was pretty cool. I don't know if I'm still going to buy the app. <laughs> I think I'm just still going to, I'm not going to, I might get a free trial for that show maybe, <clears throat> but I yeah. don't think I'm going to buy it still. So I don't know. And I think that app is going away anyways. I think it's going to be merged with another app that I forgot. Like, like Warner maybe or yeah, something? Yeah, Warner Media or because something. I think it's going to be merged because a, there's going to be like HBO. You hear about HBO that? HBO Max. HBO Max. Right? It's going to have, 
I think um, it's gonna be between Warner Brothers and the HBO stuff. It's gonna a be bunch a bunch of other stuff. Com- combination. Like they're coming together to try to compete with Netflix for sure. Yeah, Netflix yeah. and Disney Plus, which we'll get to more yep. about Disney Plus or mm-hmm. later. Oh, good. Because later, I, that's yeah. gonna this down the list, man. Okay, that cool, list, cool. Right, Sorry, we'll I'll try to run through this later then. because we got a lot of stuff to go over. Right. Jay and Silent Bob reboot. What do you think? Uh, looks good. Looks good. So it looks good. I, looks I, good. I, we Seen haven't seen that kind of comedy in a while, so I'm I kind of kind of a raunchy ish. Yeah, real kind of raunchy, like just I love it. Stupid. I love it. I want to watch jokes and stuff. You know, that's a completely. I was gonna say we haven't had a good comedy in a long time. I think. I don't think we've had a good comedy. Yeah, yeah. like, um, like you think of like really, really good, good comedies. I think of like fucking uh, Talladega Nights. Yeah. Or old school. I don't know. I mean, yeah. and that's just because I have Will and Ferrell in it. More they than just 10 happen years to ago. be hilarious. That's like literally, like almost 10, 15 years yeah, ago. Yeah, yeah. What else has come out there? Like, maybe I'm sure. Like, the only I'm other sure comedy I really, really liked is the 21, 22 Jump Streets. Yeah, those were good. I really like those, 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 but that's the last one I've really, really liked as far as comedies. I don't think I've like seen much comedy. Comedy lately. Oh, you don't think the stubber is gonna be good? Stuber? Stuber? Stuber. Yeah, I saw it last night actually. Was it good? It was fine. Yeah, I figured. Mm. Yeah. So fine. that's kind of the. About I the... was hoping, but nah. I mean, I, had I some... feel like most comedies right now are just romantic comedies. You know what I mean? Even then, there's not a lot of romantic comedies. Yeah. But nothing. I think I comedy is kind of going to the wayside. It's just all big, big blockbusters and reboots. Because that's what's mm. making money right now. Yeah. So like, that's so. A, it's a Hollywood trend. And Marvel's that's the doing thing it. Too. Everyone wants to do it too. It's, if it's not a like a good yeah, comedy, Thor it's was a, a like comedy. a. Yeah, but it's still, it's part of a comic book thing. Still yeah, they action, made it more superhero comic. genre. Mm. Yeah, I will. I I agree. It's more lean towards comedy, but yeah. That other than that, I mean, yeah, yeah. It's still, uh, yeah. But yeah, like, the, well, like what I was saying, like if it's not uh, kind of like a comedy like that, it's a super raunchy comedy. Yeah. You know, and it's like I don't always want to see a raunchy comedy. I just want to see a good, like give me a good, good one, good solid yeah. story. Yeah, something. Just get me another super bad. That's give me another airplane. That's what I want. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's, that's kind good. of what we're getting with the, the reboot, Sound, right? Well, kind of, yeah. Right? I mean, it's kind I mean, of just this just ridiculous, over, the over the top. top yeah, lots yeah. of cameos so, just Dick and fart jokes, it. man. The, sto- the story is they're going to go stop a reboot of their movie being made. Of, of their movie re- being rebooted. rebooted. That, that's what I'm saying, yeah. 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 So, uh, and the person directing their shit is Kevin Smith? I think I heard, so. They say his name. They say his name. So it's I'm like, like super duper mega. Yeah, I meant, yeah, they're going to do what they did with like... Ben yeah, Affleck I mean, and, and which uh, I thought was cool that he's back and they're friends again. Yeah. they weren't like in real life. No, 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 yeah, no, they were life. they were fighting for I did not a long yeah. time. They weren't speaking to each other. I didn't yeah, know. Yeah, and so like they just started speaking yeah. from See? this movie See? again. Who the fuck is Jennifer Lopez? <laughs> fuck you. Actually, Jennifer Gardner. Yeah. And Jennifer Gardner. Fuck, fuck you. you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fuck us. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm a married man. That'll show so. you. That'll show you. <laughs> Fuck us. Uh, the next one on the list is an HBO show, His Dark Materials. Which oh, was, yeah, yeah. We, we saw the movie. We it came out like 10 years ago, The Golden Compass. Yeah, and I was Craig. just... Saying not month. too long ago, I was like, what, what the fuck ever, like, they Do you remember that trailer? That. Do you remember the trailer, how they showed things on the trailer that was not in the movie at all? Yes. Like, like, she falls off the flying boat, and then they're, like, at this big thing, and it's like, oh, it's a big finale, and, like, that's not in the movie at all. Yeah, no, no. no. It's super yeah, really? weird. Yeah, because yeah, the movie ends with her on this flying boat, but the trailer shows of her falling off the boat, a big finale, and, like, none of that's in the not movie. Even, and it's, like, a solid, yeah. like, two hours, and weird. you're like, wow, that is so weird. Like, almost added... nothing happens in that fucking that. thing. It's and then really it was kind of like, okay, I wonder what's going to happen in the next one. I heard and this then, was a great book series, and then... They never, never fucking happened. Did a sequel because I don't think it well, made enough weird. money. And I then mean, I, I never they're... saw it, so I don't. I didn't well, know. this trailer looked pretty cool. Yeah, yeah it looks this cool. one actually looks cool. Looked, this one actually I mean, kind of piqued my interest. McAvoy, but... I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. McAvoy. yeah. yeah man. Uh, I like myself, Lin Manuel Miranda, big theater person, so yeah. I like the yeah. Hamilton guy. Yeah, he's in there. He does a lot of things uh, in the Heights, other things. Obviously. Little little girl from Logan is in it. Yeah, Daphne Keene. Daphne Keene. She's not speaking Spanish this time. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I, th- I think it looked pretty good though. Yeah, it, it looks was very fine. interesting. I, I could I, I could watch it. For yeah, someone who never it. saw the movie, like, do you think I should watch the movie then watch the show? No. Do you think it's worth? I don't, yeah, I don't, just, think, I don't so. think so. I mean, if you want to do it out of interest. Yeah, if you want to do it just to try it's and get a, background it's not lore, totally go ahead. Wasted time. I don't but think. I don't think you would need to see that before coming into this. But the stuff they're talking about in this trailer is any of that like mentioned or done in the movie? 
Like they're like, oh, the magistrates and the, the chaos sort and the magic. Of. Sort of. Like, yeah, yeah, it's just the movie's two hours, and this show is probably like ten hours. Ten episodes. So they have you know a bunch of bunch, bunch of extra of stuff. Okay. stuff that they have. Uh, so either way, it looks good. Looks fun. Yeah, I think it looks cool. Looks yeah. Good. The next thing on the list is another HBO show, The Watchmen. Oh, yeah. Yes. What do you think? Uh, I liked. I liked the trailer. Uh, um, yeah. Okay. So <clears throat> the timeline now is okay. what I'm. It's it's after I the events. It's after. I think it's right? post. Pretty because sure it's now there's like the Rorschach cult, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's kind of happening, and then. Uh, they st- uh, so that ex- that's not the original executioner guy. Then is that a new guy? I don't know. Maybe imitating. I, I thought the same thing too. I was like, wait, but he was part of the the uh, original, not the uh, like the nineteen. Yeah, min- the Minutemen. The Minutemen. Yes. Yeah. I'm sorry. Um. So maybe that's just a new guy taking up his mantle, kind of the way. Uh, um, what is the it? Night owl. The night owl. Night owl. Sorry. Yes. Yeah. God, it's been so fucking yeah, so yeah. long since I watched it. Um, so I imagine it's like it's maybe a situation like that where if maybe someone he knew yeah. or yeah took up the mantle or something like that maybe it looked it looked pretty cool though yeah it looked interesting yeah I didn't care much for the first teaser that they released I was kind of like oh, okay like looks fine <clears throat> but this trailer I had liked the concepts looks really cool like all all the cops are hiding their faces so they don't get killed I'm like oh yeah. that's a really cool interesting concept yeah a, a, uh, de- definitely a different tone from the last one where yeah. it's like a lot more political I think it yeah. is than than the last one. Yeah. Whereas the last one did definitely focused on the like all the key the, crusaders the and the thing. yeah. And you're like okay. And I think more morality, right? Where I'm sure this one's gonna also straddle that, right? With cops being you know covered up and yeah. that line that ladies like, what's the difference between a, a vigilante, vigilante and a cop covering their face? She's like, I mean, there, there's no but difference. I, yeah, that's like how the Minutemen started, right? Mm-hmm. Is they were all cops, and then it was they just got tired of that shit, mm-hmm. so they wore the funny outfits and then just started mm-hmm. beating the shit out of the bad guys. <clears throat> yeah. So it looks really cool. I mean, I'm really excited. It's the same writer from the Leftovers. Did y'all watch that show? Oh, uh, heard it was a really good show. That's so, the one where they all disappear, right? Yeah. And, and, they, yeah. and there's still people left over. Yeah. So I heard it was a really good show, and I think this is gonna be really good. I said it, bro. <laughs> or it's also like when you have when you have dinner, but you leave it in the fridge, and huh? then the next day you're like, hey, let's have leftovers. Yeah, it's left over. <laughs> uh, so then now, well, I'll go to the next series. Next series, we're jumping to Netflix. Okay. The Witcher. Yes. Dude, this trailer looked fucking awesome. Yes. I thought he looked fucking weird as shit when he was like flexing. Yeah, like, yeah. There was that one like, shot. He looked mm-hmm. fucking overly mm-hmm. beefy. Like, oh, I was like, is that really him? Like that looked fuck? like a weird. fucking weird muscle I think it's probably suit. a weird shot. I don't know. I, don't I think know, it's probably dude. a weird shot. Because, I mean, well, do they ever show him with his clothes off any other time? I didn't even realize. But I just, it felt like his proportions I looked fine. I don't remember him being that buff in the game, dude. Yeah. No, definitely not. I think it's probably just no. a weird shot no, or maybe he just some like, potion. I mean, he was just like, oh, maybe. Okay. Maybe. Okay, I'll buy that. Maybe it's something like that. Maybe he took like a fucking strength like a potion, or, potion or yeah, something to make him like more enhanced. And he's just fucking jacked, and he's yeah. just like, you know, and that yeah. Okay, I'll I'll buy that. Uh, like the only thing I could but think if of, it, but if that's just him, fucking <laughs> oh, Jesus, dude, dude, he's a fucking Cause, monster. Cause the thing about the Witcher is he has to be taking, I think, like this vial, like this medicine, to like uh, stop his like inner monster from actually yeah, coming. Yeah, oh, is that why the thing is the, trailer the thing like is that? yeah, that's why they showed him like he flips to the black eyes when he's about to fight that monster at the end or whatever. Spider monster. The spider monster or whatever. Right. Um, because the there is monster? like some kind of no, there is like some kind of curse going on with him. So Shilab. maybe, Shilab. <laughs> maybe he was still coming <laughs> off that. Transformation or something. I, I don't Could know. Be, yeah. right? Maybe. But yeah. overall, I think it looks cool. Overall, looks I like a good the tone of it is so series. cool. They got, they got the good. lore there, right? Where they were talking about the elves teaching them magic. And yeah. Then humans killed them off or whatever. I was like, dude, like this. Yeah. Uh, like, yeah it's, it, it seems like it's. I'm fucking hyped. good. I think this is the I'm first Netflix it. show that I'm actually excited for. Yeah. And you know what I hate about most Netflix show trailers slash movie trailers that they have is mm-hmm. that they show everything. Yeah. They show everything. There's a new movie I didn't put on here with uh, Chris Evans. It's a movie coming out like next week. And uh, dude, they showed the whole movie in that trailer. Oh, the Snowpiercer? Uh, no, <laughs> not that. But it's uh, there's another Snowpiercer. 
But it's like some like. What the f- why the fuck are you laughing? <laughs> it's it was on that list, asshole. Snowpiercer. You talking about Chris Evans? You talking about snow? And, why is that such well, a big I, leap I know to he you? Comes out in, but you like that's what you you don't you associate him with the Snowpiercer. Is there? <laughs> okay, question. You're acting like Snowpiercer is part of the the list of stuff. That it was on there, but not not this list. It was on the list I got. What is there a new Snowpiercer? A TV show, yeah. It, but it's based on the Snowpiercer stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. See, that's what I didn't know. See. See how you filled in that blank. See. You said a show with Chris Evans. You didn't say Snowpiercer. Movie with Chris. Evans. I thought you, movie with Chris. See, Evans. I thought you were just calling him the Snowpiercer, <laughs> like, <laughs> like instead of like it's, Captain America. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's okay. that's where that's yeah. what's happening in here. Okay. It'll always be Johnny Storm to me. <laughs> <laughs> For real, dude. I could not take Captain America really? as as Captain America because all I saw was Johnny Storm. I just saw him as this cocky little no, asshole no. I, shit. I, I went in there pre-wiped. Yeah, same. No, I, I wiped. I, yeah, I saw. I wiped that shit it from was my very, fucking hard drive. Matter bro. of fact, it wasn't until uh, not even first Avenger. Probably uh, what was the one after that? Was that? The first one. Uh, no, yeah, but it, I'm saying the one after that. Avengers. Uh, what was the next Captain America movie after that? It was um, Winter Soldier. Winter Soldier. That's the first time I was like, Civil oh, War. Cool, this is fucking Cap. Infinity War. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what a soldier, Caleb. <laughs> Otherwise, I just saw him as fucking, fucking Johnny Storm, man. I hated that. Johnny Storm. Johnny There's Storm. a storm. Moving on. Uh, there. Now we have movie trailers. Oh, ready? Oh. The ones we care about, <laughs> or at least the ones I wrote down. Right. Yeah, yeah. Twenty One Bridges isn't on here. Okay, I don't care. Okay, I didn't see it. First one I'm talking about it too. Did you see the trailer for it too? Uh, you did not. That's I, fine. I, I've seen the one that they've been showing in theaters with the old naked lady. No, this one's way better. Yeah, this, this, one's, one's, this one's way yeah? better. This okay, one's cool. way fucking better. I just uh, figured, like, so okay, it's back. I get it. Scary stuff's going to happen. The second trailer's better. It's okay. way, way fucking better. What'd you think? I mean, I, I like the, the part finally that they have. Because, you know, you're always kind of like, oh, is that is that this person? Is it this one? How they're showing the faces now in the in the trailer with the, the kids' faces and oh, then yeah, it's yeah. adults. Mm-hmm. So I like that because that, I'm more of a visual person. Yeah, yeah. So that connects a little bit better. And then, ah, fuck, man. It was really good, dude. All, the, when his tongue's on the fucking... <laughs> Spoilers. So fucking good. It's uh, it looks really good. Okay, it looks really good. It looks really good, man. Yeah. All, yeah. Everything. It's September 6th. It's coming quick. I'm surprised yeah. they don't move it closer to Halloween. October. I mean, I... True. I, it's... Oh. It looks I can't good. wait, dude. I can't wait to fucking see that movie. I'm it's going to be great. I, I like how it says the end... I like how they, it's so interesting. We don't get movies like this anymore where it's just a two-part movie and it ends like that. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. You don't end, get, end? It's going to end, end. Yeah, it's still going it's off the, the first end of the book. Story, yeah. Question. So, okay, so then It 2 is like the second half of the book? Correct. More okay. or less, yes. Did the original It movie cover both The original parts? It wasn't a movie. It was, it was a, a series. TV movie. TV uh, movie series that was like. That covered the second half part of it? Or? Yeah. Well, it's because in the book it goes back and forth. Mm. It, the the book's fucking huge, dude. That thing's like I've a seen massive. Big, yeah. It's yeah. forty four yeah, hours on Audible. Huge. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ. I it's a whole write. work week. Yeah, dude. Jesus. <laughs> okay. So, um, the series was pretty good. It, it explained a lot or whatever. It had them as the the kids, and then they're you know that's basically the first half, and then the second half is when they're adults. So okay. They're, okay. they're, they're doing it good. Cool. Dude. Okay. Yeah. I, like, I enjoyed excited. the first one, so yeah. I, was, cast, I already knew I was going to watch the second one. Yeah, so cool. the second one we have, second trailer, and the last trailer, yes, um, <clears throat> Top Gun 2. Yeah, Top Gun yeah, 2. Top Gun 2. So um, I thought, I was like, oh man, he's going to be like the instructor, uh-huh. right? But nah, <laughs> he's fucking, he's, <laughs> he's back in flying, it, dude. dude. He's still fucking <laughs> flying. I was like, oh, okay, there's not going to be a new Top Gun. Yeah, I, thought I was, was like, he's going to be, training the yeah, he's going to be training something. the new Top Guns wow. and shit. Nope. nope. <laughs> he's still yeah, I, I was like, oh man, he's, there it was Viper. I was like, he's going to take Viper's spot, right? Uh-huh. As the fucking, you know, teacher and shit. Nope. Yeah, yeah. I did, dude, Tom Cruise is so cool, man. Like, when you see that POV shot of him in the dude. actual aircraft, yeah. he's actually <laughs> flying it. Dude, that looks so fucking cool. Like he shot. actually, because I, I saw the interview with him and Conan, and he went to freaking flying school, and he's in those shots. Oh, he's shit. actually flying the jet. He oh, put the camera shit. in. I think he had some of the actors, too, train. And, dude, 
those, those shots so were awesome. pretty cool though like yeah, where you so can awesome. see the whole cockpit now yeah just, yeah. yeah like you think about like the advancement of, of like uh, cameras and technology and stuff yeah. like that <laughs> where you could i mean you you think you're, you're so confined in a space like that but you can see like behind him yeah. like it's just so fucking cool, man. We're gonna get fucking more aerial dog fights, dude. Yeah. Dude, that's gonna be. We haven't seen awesome. that in a movie in a long time dude, either. Yeah, I right? thought about that too. That's what I was gonna say. We haven't had a good fucking like like fighter plane like uh, movie in fucking forever. Yeah. yeah. Right. Because we used to get not just regular like Top Gun, but we had like. Uh, the the last air, um, starfighter, Airbender. <laughs> <laughs> the last starfighter, yeah. uh, and, and uh, other Return of the Jedi. There. there we go. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> kind of works actually. Yeah, yeah it does. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, dude. So yeah, we just get World War Two movies. I'm like, I'm sick of Nazi movies, man. I'm sick of them. Same. I'm sorry if you're offended, them. but I'm sick of World War Two. Mega offended. Mega sick of slavery movies. Oh my You're god! Sick of World War II movies. Of, I got a movie for you, Caleb. It's called what? Overlord. You should go check it out. Okay, that one I liked because they mixed it up a bit. <laughs> I, I liked it. I know. I'm kidding. Uh, anyways, <laughs> Top Gun Two looks great. Top Gun Two. I wasn't Top Gun 2 in, another great. movie. I wasn't excited. excited for it until I saw the trailer. I was like, Nah, I'm excited. Excited. Yeah, looks cool. Uh, and that's it for all the trailer stuff that I wrote down. Important stuff. Cool. Was there anything else I wanted to talk about that I missed? Um, not nothing really. I, I just quick snippet. Uh, Young Justice. I don't know if you all saw Young Justice, nah, but I it. It, the I mean, it's been in hiatus, but they keep, yeah. they're coming back with a season four now. On a DC. And as far as like DC animation shows that I was interested in, I liked Young Justice actually. Right. So it's cool that they announced that they're they're doing another one of those. Sweet. Cool, 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 cool. Mm-hmm. Now to the big thing. Yes. What the big kahuna. What do we got? Give it uh, out. Whip it, it out, Caleb. Caleb. Whip it out. Avengers beat Avatar at the box office. Boom, oh, bitch. Shit, that's right. I forgot about that. Everyone Take that shit. That. Dances with wolves with blue elves. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking idiots. And your, and your hair. Yeah. And your hair. And, and you know what? And I thought about it. I was like, Little man. Navi like Navi fucking bastards. It's been this long since Endgame, and it finally surpassed. Like, how the f- how the fuck did Avatar make that much money? Avatar is this uh, weird thing. Here's the thing. The I'll 3D? give you no, some I, Yes. The that's, 3D that's why. It's the fucking 3D. Well, the 3D it was the first was time the first yeah. 3D came back, and it was fucking amazing, yeah. and everyone blew their goddamn minds, and yeah. that's why everyone ran to the movies. Here's the thing, too. Avatar didn't open to, like, a... 200 million 300 million opening it only opened to like 80 million but the thing was every week after that it stayed at like 80 million 78 like it stayed constant every box office weekend after that and like it did this thing did the star wars thing where it opens in the end of december and in all of january there's nothing coming out that's good yeah so it just people just keep going back and seeing it uh obviously china and other world other countries like stupid movies yeah, yeah. big blockbusters so yeah, yeah. that helps that so it's avatar it, st- it also stayed in the theater a long time too mm-hmm. kind of like endgame but i think they kind of kept endgame in there for purposely um Good. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But they, they most most movies spot. don't Take stay in the theater this money. long. Yeah. But Avatar was still at that time where they would st- they would stay in the theater theater as long as it did. So because what Avatar came out in twenty ten, yeah, two thousand nine, I think two thousand nine, two thousand ten. Mm-hmm. So yeah, a lot of the factors Avatar. That's why Avatar has such a higher world record. In game came out, and we're like, oh, it's gonna beat it. Then it slowed down a lot. We're like, oh, I don't know, dude. They kept it in the theaters. <laughs> like, just keep going, seeing it. We'll keep it in there. And it eventually surpassed it. So I'm happy. Uh, Avatar can finally go away. Yeah. Not be number one anymore. True. Yeah. Yeah. Now uh, we can look forward to Avatar 2. No! <laughs> I Dude, honestly... It, um, I'd watch it. Well, <laughs> it's I honestly wonder if it's going to get... The same the like, same praise because who mean, cares james, yeah. he's doing his fucking research man he he went all the way down to the mariana trench and shit further down there is than anyone's gone to go look at fucking uh life down there to do research for his new fucking for avatar too. did yeah. y'all see the terminator dark fate footage uh yes i did did you like it I, yeah yeah, yeah i liked like what it? i saw i didn't like the trailer that came out i hated it because it was like the first oh, one yeah yeah the only trailer that came out really yeah. for dark fate okay uh, I hated it because it was like, oh, another new Terminator that can do more things and yeah. some more, harder to kill. But this time it's got Sarah Connor. I don't care. Well, she's old. Well, this one, I don't care. Okay. And it's and old it's, Sarah Connor. And, and she's it's, like, it's doing the thing where boom, it's like, boom, boom, boom. She's still a <laughs> badass, you know? I don't care. And with every footstep, it boom, 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 <laughs> shotgun blast. And it's and then it's like, oh, I'm wearing it's my shades. And I got, 
no recoil on that yeah. fucking baby. Yeah, I don't care. I really um, no. And, no, and, I and don't. new Terminator's like. Now I'm just gonna you double know, myself. Do that Hollywood fucking <laughs> thing where I'm just gonna <laughs> and yeah, I come out of nothing, <laughs> and now I'm solid as a rock. <laughs> <laughs> It's metal, I mean. This whole segment was just sound effects. I mean, it, it looks cool. Yeah. Take my um, money. Fine, I'll go watch it. Oh, wait, but Arnold's back. Dude, Like, he's Arnold's in back. every movie. Dude, he's Arnold's back in every back, movie. bro. That's so dumb. I hate when they, like, he's oh, back. he's back. He's back in every movie. That's true. He doesn't do shit, man. <laughs> he's so he dumb. But he's back. back. Like, I don't once That's every the reveal. Two, three years. I don't care so much. But um, the featurette was cool. I liked it. Well, Gave me a little bit more hope. What well, gave me more that. hope was that James Cameron like was there, right? Saying, is he directing still? No, he's like producing, right, or something like that. The director is the director. Of Deadpool. I mean, they're they're gonna. Uh, yeah, it's a Miller. Deadpool director. Tim Miller. Okay, mm-hmm. that's right. Which I gives me a little bit more hope as same, well. He's same. more excited about it. I feel like he'll do it just. And that's as why much I was can. like, take my monies, because I'm like, this is gonna be a fucking action movie. Yeah, like R-rated. this is gonna be oh, something R-rated to watch. Too. That was another thing that was confirmed was that it's gonna be R rated. Yeah, so I mentioned so it'll that's be, cool too. You know, it's visceral or whatever. I will get my one. visual <clears throat> stimuli when I go watch it. It's gonna be great. Yeah. I'm not excited until I see it. I'll I'm see not going happens. for the story. I'm going for the guns, the explosion. I'm going for both. Maybe, I'm, I'm maybe some titties. With the story. Same. Uh, I mean, I would like it. Yeah, that's a bonus. But I mean, the last good fucking Terminator movie was what, in your opinion? T two. T two. I mean, I like the one with Christian Bale. I thought that one was awesome. Is that so that's what I was gonna say. Was I actually didn't watch those. It was fine. I wanted to. The Christian Bale one wasn't it was bad. Fine. Yeah, I like that one. I but, hated the thing I hated about that one was the trailer. Because it gave away the movie. <clears throat> I don't know if you remember. Yeah, I do. Remember? Because so it, it shows the no, guy. No, 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 no. I'll show you right now. So yeah. the rain guy. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, so, it, sh- it shows you. It shows there's a big reveal, and it doesn't tell you. The whole movie, you don't know it. And then, like, literally, like, the third act of the movie, they show that part. Oh, like, damn. dude, that was the big that reveal. Was, was and you deal. didn't realize Thank it. Thank God I haven't even. I've just been. Yeah. Real quick, I did want to say about this. Um. What what I like is that they're not jumping to like a super more crazier advanced T T whatever. That's what it 2000s. is. What do you mean? No, that's, what a, that's what it is. It just it's, fucking particled in the fucking. No, no, but it's it's like it takes place like before like what was it? Because oh. we're gonna pretend that part three didn't happen, right? Yeah, any of it happened. And part three. Well, they fixed it. Yeah. Basically, no, the Christian Bale was, one fixed it. No, it's a. But it's, they're gonna pretend like that one didn't even happen. Which yeah, also it's doing a sequel to, to Judgment Day. That's what yeah. it's doing. So it's pretending everything else didn't happen, and it's a sequel to Judgment Day. What? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's what it's doing. It's pretending none of the other Terminators happen except one and two. Yeah, it's doing what? the Halloween. Yes. It's doing the Halloween thing. Yes. <laughs> yeah. This is confirmed. Yeah, yes. that's it's legit confirmed. Yeah. That's that's the thing. That's why Sarah Connor's <laughs> there. Yeah. Also, that's also why Sarah Connor's <laughs> there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right. See, I don't. I don't need to watch Dark Fate Fuck now. Fuck it. I'm in. I'm in. Let's do it. Whatever. Right. We, uh, we can do it. I mean, here's so. Fuck them. Fuck everything else. Right. <laughs> <laughs> why 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 fix the storyline and then well, just the fuck it up line, again the storyline is like the x-men universe it's super confusing yeah now. it is especially with genesis but, genesis made but it the super Christian confusing genesis, genesis. Fixed it. genesis no was it that, didn't because genesis did. came after and genesis messed up everything and i hated it genesis did. too it was a stupid fucking that's why they're gonna pretend it didn't happen man yeah that's why we're just they're um, rebooting everything but going back to my original thing was <sighs> i was just gonna say that the T, what are they calling it? T eight hundred. I don't know. T nine hundred. T poop thousand. Because and, uh, Arnold was the T eight hundred. No? Wait, oh, man. Wait. If this is yeah. a sequel to Judgment Day, yeah. I gotta oh, watch the fucking trailer. The kid, now. new eyes. The kid in Judgment Day is gonna be back as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also I think confirmed. I, he was in the trailer, wasn't he? No, but um, he's confirmed to be back in the movie. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Um, didn't he like? I, in real life shit wasn't he like through rehab and all yeah, this other I think shit so. really fucking bad I think so oh, are man. you talking about um, doing, that fucking what's his name the one in Detroit John Rock Connor? City yeah John Connor yeah, yeah. the kid he's, he's gonna coming be back. he's coming back oh yeah. cool yeah I know that yeah, yeah. Wow. I hope he does good man I hope he doesn't fuck it up so that was don't fuck it up dude <laughs> I wanna Miller. see you in more shit Tim Mahler are y'all ready uh, for back uh, to my original point oh yeah <laughs> we're still coming to that 
<laughs> no, real quick, I was just gonna say. Uh, so T one thousand was liquid metal, right? Right. Correct. And in part three, what did she do differently? I don't know any of the other ones. Right? No, I don't remember. care. She does. She also liquid metals, and That's, she yeah. also has well, flaming arms. Her arm. thing was that she could hack any fucking. Oh yeah, that was her thing. Uh, anything. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's computer stuff. She could. She could hack any fucking thing and turn it into her her uh, yeah, control. So she this can one... hack into police cars that had no technology at that Correct. time. Correct. And could just drive them away. That's right. She so, would. Make, looking back, that makes no sense. No, it's retarded as fuck. <laughs> so this thing looks like a T800, but a little bit different. But it has the powers of like a T1000. I don't know. Right? Okay. They, All right. They, well, just... They're going to do whatever they want to do. Okay. Mm-hmm. It's stupid. I'm also, still going to go watch it. I'm still gonna watch it. Looks I'm just, interesting. Uh, we'll see what happens. We'll yeah. see when the movie comes out. That's all. I can't. I'm not gonna give any more judgment. Yeah. I, eh, whatever. It just. I think the plot and the story is, is different enough that there's not necessarily like a nostalgic feeling. Like, I mean, it's not like they're playing the old music or whatever. You know, like I'm. Which I think it would have been better if they played. If that they trailer. did, I think I'd be like ten they times more hyped. The, if they just did the yeah. The, yeah. I mean, <laughs> if they did, it would have to be when they show Arnold's face. Probably. Maybe yeah, they do that in right. the movie. He's in every scene. He's in every. No, it would have to be. I don't that care. That moment when he opens the door to the yeah. cabin. Dun, 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 dun. They come inside. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> See, damn, already yeah. blood pump. Blood yeah, pump. Like, I'm ready. My wallet's already <laughs> itchy. <laughs> the helicopter. <laughs> yeah, man. I would. You know, what I would prefer is a Terminator <laughs> salvation. <laughs> Like I want to turn around salvation, but like make it more actiony. What they why they're going through the desert, walking everywhere, you boring. Make explosions. I want more explosions. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Is I was bored with the setting a little bit. Yeah. All right. I'm like, where is Sick this? Sick of the What's time happening? travel. Sick of it. Yeah, I don't know. Well, well I, I didn't I watch the last two. I love two, time so. travel. I, the last Terminator, I remember, was Genesis three. was horrible. Cool. Horrible. I'm, I, I'm still Moving interested in checking it out. <laughs> Moving on. Moving on. Moving on. To why you're here. Why we know are you why you're here. here? We know why you're here. It's for phase four. Phase, phase four. 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 They, fuck, they said it. They, <laughs> they put out a fucking picture graph of everything. <laughs> I'm excited. I'm uh, excited. I'm going to give it to y'all in order. Boop, 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 boop. In order. First one, May 2020, Black Widow. Oh, that's a show, right? No, that's a movie. Oh, it's a yeah. movie. Yeah, this is why I'm doing the news and you're just commenting <laughs> off of it. That's right, Frank. That's right. Because we've been That's away right, on Frank. vacation <laughs> That's with right. no internet for a fucking week. It's a movie, and the villain is rumored. No, not rumored. It is confirmed. Taskmaster. Taskmaster. That's right. Oh. Which I wasn't excited oh. until I heard that, and I was like, oh, that's cool. Now, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. See, because I was like, oh, okay, it's going to be like the Sparrow about, right, fucking whatever. movie with yeah. the, uh, uh, Jennifer Lawrence, Jennifer right? Jennifer Lawrence. I was like, it's going to be that? Okay, except Ooh, maybe boring. less graphic because it's fucking Disney. Yeah. But Taskmaster, Taskmaster. fuck yeah, yeah dude. Yeah, yeah. I'm in. Same. Watching it. Same. Watching it. Then fall of 2020, you get the show or movie. I think it's a movie. I could be wrong. I think these are all movies, uh, if I'm not Some mistaken. Some of them are shows. The WandaVision. Uh, sorry to cut your stuff ahead. I, I, but like that's WandaVision why I got a little confused show, on the Disney Plus ones. I think what, some of them are shows and movies. Okay. We'll just say okay. we'll right, just we'll say what they are. Falcon Winter Soldier, fall 2020. Definitely show. Uh, I'm excited. Definitely show? Yeah, I don't. Show. I don't know. I remember reading that was going to be a show. I don't know. It's like it's, way, like, it's like, like a Cappy. A uh, Cappy. Cappy? Cappy. A Chappy? It's Buck. Cappy. Bucky? Bucky and Cappy? Buck, buck, buck Cappy? Bucky Cappy. Bucky. He's going to buck a cap. <laughs> He's going to buck a cap. Cappy. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> I was gonna say new cap and Bucky Adventures. Uh, I mean, that's that's what I was gonna say. But yeah, yeah. so Falcon is confirmed to be Captain America, which yeah. I'm happy right. because they were saying for not a bit, happy. they were like, not oh, Cap- happy. They were saying, oh, Falcon's not gonna be Captain America. And I was like, that doesn't make any sense. And they gave him the shield. They gave him the shield. He's gonna be Captain. Yeah, the new Captain America. Setting. So setting. why don't you it like that? Because comics. it should be fucking Bucky. Yeah, it's fine. You know what? Either way, Maybe it should be Bucky. No, because Bucky's not ready. Bucky's not ready. He's, not he's ready still yet. like an enemy of the state, sort of. Yeah, yeah. He's got to get. If this was comics, fits, I would say yes. Been Bucky. I mean, what if this all leads to like they're getting Bucky ready to Look, become? No, but it makes more sense in no, this universe. It won't. In this universe, it makes more sense. Yes. I would rather Bucky be the Winter Soldier anyway. 
because the Winter Soldier is more of a fucking badass. Yeah, that's and what I'm saying. I would it want Bucky sense to get his hands dirty yeah, and be let, all let, cool. Let fucking, yeah, yeah, uh, let let him be the be goody. the the goody yeah, yeah. guy. Yeah, the goody and, guy. Uh, it, it's just I don't I can't see, I, I, I don't, he's not likable. Is it because you don't like black people? No. <laughs> <laughs> he, this Falcon no, you don't. This Falcon <laughs> character is not likable. Right. He's fine. I mean, I he like was him. okay, and he was he was I mean, funny. Look, I just don't see him as a leader type, at, like Cap is. He's. Not, I don't. Think I he's, don't. I don't see him filling Cap's role. He's not gonna he's not replace going to. his shoes he, per se, but well, he's just he's he's just passing the mantle. He, if he's Captain America, that is a fucking high standard, and I don't think that Sam Wilson can fucking fill it. I think you can. Okay. Well, look. It's I don't not, think you can. It's not, I don't think you can, Sam. He's not going to be Captain America in like a movie capacity. I think they're going to be more like they're not having these like defending the Earth kinds of yeah, adventures. yeah, exactly. It's like they're, they're diminishing these... Cap's status, Frank. <laughs> he's not fucking movie strength material no longer. You know what? He's TV Although, show. Here's the thing. Fucking CW type. Disney Plus. <laughs> That's the thing. Plus. We have not seen what a Marvel Studio show looks like. That's also true. So, so this is what, why these are not This is the why regular... Disney Plus has my money. I mean, yeah. the shows that are going to put on here or movies or whatever. If uh, the quality is fucking great, I think it's going to be. Dude, it's Disney might, money. That might switch. Remember when you were last that's week true, you were saying man. Amazon money? Fuck, Dude, that's Disney, Disney money. money. But it's that's Marvel fucking Studios Disney money. Too, with just Disney like, money. Yes, with Disney, Disney so money. Like... Fuck. Yeah, it's it's going to well, be Well, let's it's see how stingy Disney will be because you know, I saw, you know, fucking their stupid shows on TV now, right? Their kids like shows. Like Henry Danger? Like fucking... Like DuckTales? No, man. Those are great. Oh, I'm talking about like shit. the fucking Wizards of Waverly Place or some That's other That's like 10 years shit. old, man. That's what I'm saying. Those fucking but shows. But they're not be like that. <laughs> I'm, hoping, I'm, I'm hoping. I'm like, hoping that Winter Soldier, <laughs> Winter Soldier and <laughs> Captain Bucky are not like Wizards they're of not Waverly gonna, Place. That's my fear, They're kid. not going to be laugh That's tracks. That's my fucking fear. They're not going to be laugh tracks in the really show. I really <laughs> hope it isn't. Oh, my oh gosh. My it's going to be good, Because dude. that's what Sam fucking Wilson is to me, man. He's just uh, a laugh track boy. All right? Is, he's not fucking Captain America material. So what if, I mean, they just do like iCarly, like they're just, you know, <sighs> like vlogging in the bedroom. Hey, guys. <laughs> you know, We're on I our blog. feel like little I, stupid, like everything's moving on the I'd sides for no reason. An episode, maybe. <laughs> I'd give it a shot. One Dude, it's going to, I guarantee you it's going to be good. It's going to be like a Netflix show, if not better. Okay. Yeah. I guarantee Okay, well, We'll see when a trailer starts coming. Res- my reserves, thoughts reserved. <laughs> yeah. Forget next, what I said. <laughs> next thing in the same year, this is the third thing in that year, November 6, 2020, The Eternals. Eternals. Oh, Eternals. We're going cosmic. We're going cosmic. Going cosmic. I have no opinion. I mean, um, I mean, once the trailer comes out, I'm sure I'll be excited. Uh, I mean, Angelina Jolie, right? Yeah. Summer Height. But when has she been a cool thing? Angelina Jolie? Yeah. I mean, she, Mr. and Mr. Smith. That was 15 years old, man. That, I mean, you said that's when. Last, you, that's I'm that's answering your question, last, sir. She's I meant it like in a sarcastic, like when, when's the last time she's been cool? That's why her casting doesn't make me excited. I didn't, I mean, Maleficent? I didn't, I didn't watch the <laughs> Mal- Maleficent stuff, but I, that's, that's, that's like the She old. turns around. Yeah, she, I'm like, whoa. She's still, hot. Oh my she's gosh. still got it, man. Come Ooh. on. She's, she's making her comeback. She's she's joining the cast as an internal. We'll see, we'll see. I, that's why I'm just saying her casting doesn't make me excited. You know what, man? I would love to have seen her be Medusa. That would have been fucking great. That would have been cool. In that show? Uh, um, <laughs> and, um, the one that got Inhumans? canceled. Yeah, Inhumans. man, Inhumans. She would have been fucking great dude, Medusa. I never even saw Inhumans. Neither did I, dude. I heard it was horrible. Neither did I. Uh, who was handling that? Was that Sony or something? No, it was Marvel. Yeah, but it was right? the Marvel TV at that time. But it's the they ones were who were doing uh, Agents of Shield, yeah. and they're okay. doing. So it was that um, same kind of budget. It was same kind of like style. It was just yeah, yeah. It was horrible. Agents of Shield is good, dude. But like, uh, I stopped watching. I stopped watching after Ghost Rider. Yeah. Stopped so watching I saw way before the Ghost Rider. So, uh, so journals, you excited? Uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, especially for what it can be. You know, we'll see. We'll see. Just, That's a movie, right? <sighs> Yes, it is that's a movie. not no, fucking. Yeah, I mean, it's a movie. It's gotta be. It's gotta yeah, be. Yeah, it's yeah. coming out twenty twenty. Uh, when did you say Black Widow? So Black Widow was. Black Widow 20? is May first, twenty twenty. May first, twenty twenty. So that'll and be the first new mo- slate of the movies. Phase four stuff. Okay. Yeah. Then twenty twenty one, February twelfth, Shang Chi, Legend of the Ten Rings, oh. Mandarin coming back. That's right. Mandarin. The real the Mandarin. Real Mandarin. Real Mandarin. Um, I'm surprised they don't have him like they're. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, what a Mandarin... pathetic loser! <laughs> <laughs> Mandarin is a bad guy, right? Correct. He's so a bad person. Why is he getting his own movie as he's, a villain? He's a bad guy. Oh no, Shang Chi Frank... is the guy. Shang Chi is the good guy. He's the good guy. Oh. He's Naruto, man. Uh, so they cast an unknown. I'm cool with that. He's, he, he's, the... he's the dude who's gonna be in um, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood as Bruce Lee, right? That's is the, he? That's, oh, that's the guy. Is that what that's gonna be? That's I think that's the guy. I don't know. We should look. I, I don't, so I don't when know. I when I looked it up, I they, they were showing his picture as oh, as this dude. That's cool, dude. His impression is spot on. Oh, it was real good. It's so it spot so on. I mean, just from the trailer, that. I haven't seen the movie mm-hmm. yet. Yeah. So, so that's good. gonna be cool. He's got the repulsor fucking nunchucks. He's uh, got the shadow like clone I, jutsu. Like I had mentioned in the in the in our text earlier in the week. I know there's going to be magic and stuff and cosmic stuff or whatever. Well, not cosmic, but, you know, magic, yeah. right? But I, my biggest hope, I just, because, again, talk about movies we haven't gotten in a while. I want to see, like, a Jackie Chan, like a Jet Li type, where you're seeing all the action happen. Oh, you know, I guess, the, no. That, J- uh, John Wick is what that is today. That's what John Wick yeah, is today. Yes, exactly. Yeah, That's man. why everyone loves it John really Wick, is. because it's, you see all the action. You see all the stuff. Yeah. It's gun fu. But I want to see that in Shang Chi. I want them if we're gonna go this, you know, kung fu guy. I want to see all the action. I want to see them dancing and doing stunts. That's what I, I want to see. I was hoping that's what Iron Fist was gonna be. <laughs> I was hoping Iron Fist was gonna be more like '70s fucking like kung fu man. Yeah. Uh, like that instead, vibe. Instead of I'm Danny Rand. Yeah, except okay. of the, I'm Danny Wynn, and I don't know what the fuck is going on, because okay. I'm a fucking clueless guy who lived on a fucking mountain for a good while. I'm a social retard. <laughs> I didn't uh, watch that either. I didn't watch it either. I heard it was horrible. I was like, I'm not going to watch it. I heard it was bad, though. That was an audio clip. Yeah. That was, I just played you an audio clip. <laughs> Same. That's when I said that. That's what it was, too. <laughs> uh, Shane Chi. Uh, from, from our responses, well, I I never I, I never read a lot of I have, yeah. When I, I was no prior knowledge when I was at my peak reading comics time, I never read anything about Shang Chi. Like I Same. I heard about him, but I never read anything specifically with him like yeah. in it in it. Um, so to me, like if it has cool like kung fu shit or whatever, that's it's all very I'm, like if it if it has that kind of vibe, I'm I'm totally stoked yeah, for that's it. That's all I'm I want. I'm in. I want more kung fu. Yes, excited. Yes. So then, also spring. Of 2021, okay. Disney Plus going back to Disney Plus yeah, is the is. WandaVision. WandaVision. Uh, Be interesting. What the fuck? How's that gonna? What adventures are they gonna get into? Family life. You know, oh my god! The laugh track still. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god! Back to that. Carly shit. It's a no! legit. It's a no! soundstage of Wanda and Vision. No. <laughs> Just Honey, to... where are my pants? I left it in the laundry. Ah. <laughs> gonna, I'm just going to phase over there. <laughs> Fa- you phased your pants on backwards, honey. Damn it. That's like the worst case I scenario. actually Dude. would watch that, though. <laughs> I would watch that. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about that one because I don't know what kind of stuff they're going to be doing. I don't I know mean, what they're going to get into. Yeah, Here's what's the thing. Their... Is like, Vision is a cool character. I feel like he, like he got less cooler with every movie he was in because he didn't yeah. do anything. Yeah. Like, Vision is uh, like super fucking smart right he's like can control Almost like God-like. all electronics type shit or whatever he can fucking phase through stuff you know what do you also have like no no, no, no. You, know, you, you know what he can blast things with this little stone what fucking iron man is now right in the Dead. last fucking <laughs> uh version of him where his suit fucking does whatever the fuck he can think yeah. of and all this other shit that's fucking vision yes he has all the fucking Vision's powers that way. Yeah, except like, Vision can also like, phase through. Like Vision can materialize shit. Yeah. And do all that shit. Iron Man shouldn't have that shit. That, that, that's another fucking well, Iron crap Man, I have. Iron Man. They made Iron Man way too fucking uh, with the whole liquid nano metal shit. That's just Hollywood yeah, getting fucking lazy, that's man. Iron man and that's lazy writing. Marvel was Capcom too. He had ion stuff. No, but that stuff was like... No, I'm not talking about the ion stuff. Okay. I'm talking about the whole liquid nanites fucking just forming to create fucking... Yeah, that shit. Iron Man. Yeah, I don't care. Again, with some of these, it's like until I see a trailer, I'm gonna be like, oh, whatever. True. Yeah. So same. Reserve judgment. Reserve. <laughs> Reserve judgment. Uh, also, spring 2021 is the Disney Plus. Keeping Disney Plus, the Loki show. This is mm. post Endgame for sure. For sure. Uh, this this Kevin is the, the Hiddleston po- that once he survived. like <clears throat> you know. Went when, away. He, when he took off with that, fucking... where is he? What adventures is he, is he gonna get into? I really. 
I, I, I would love to see a trailer. But I, I hope they keep it like um, really mysterious and. I hope they keep it fun. gritty and yes. violent and brutal. I don't think they're going to. Not, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I mean, it doesn't have to be. Brutal. They may. They I mean, just making his character uh, a little more comedic uh, and like like a lovable roguish character. So I just I can't see them. And also, if it's a show based on him, obviously, he's not the antagonist. He's the protagonist of the the show, or whatever. So it's like, what is he doing? I that's... think he's gonna be. In a situation with worse people around him, and him getting through that situation, around that situation. Yeah. yeah. I would It'll, love to see the, the, the mind behind Loki. True, yeah, right? Because whatever Loki's wherever working. he ends up going, he's in some fucking place where he's got to defend himself. And so yeah. you're I mean, there His character is interesting yeah, as fuck. That. I would love to follow him more. See, like when yeah. I'm like Wanda and Vision, I'm like, I, I don't really you don't care. I don't really care what they're doing or what they're doing or who they're fighting. But so if you they're going to have to. Yeah, but if you tell me Loki, yeah, I'm, I'm already I'm interested cool. yeah. just because it's Loki. Yeah. I already want to watch what the fuck is Loki going to get into. That yeah. dude can get into a lot of shit. Yeah. Um, the second movie of that year, 2021, this is the one I'm most excited for, Doctor Strange, the Multiverse of Madness, Dude. confirmed, also yeah. it's going to be more of a legit horror yes. movie, which I thought was crazy, that was I, very bugged, like, yeah, I'm excited do. for this, I think from this movie, they're going to spin off other movies. I think this is where you're going to get Fantastic Four. This is where you're going to get Mutants. X-Men. This is where they're going to test out these these ooh, properties. Ooh. And I think he's going to go through these multiverses, and that's where they're going to come through. Um, oh. I, mean, I think he's also... Yeah, I think this Talk is probably me, where he bro. can see... This is probably where he's going to see female Thor, too, which we'll get into later. He's going to see the female Thor. I think he'll, this is all this stuff will happen. Which will allow that kind of stuff to happen. I, this has a bunch of possibilities. I'm excited. Dude, I, Dude, you know what I hope it's like? Oh, real quick. I hope it's like the ending of Monsters, Inc., where he's just going through doors, <laughs> and <laughs> he's having stuff. to fight. So he's chasing someone, fighting someone, but obviously within the length of a film, but that's what I hope it's like. It's hope it's kind of trippy. It just keeps going through realities. and uh, That'd be cool. Like, um, well, the, they're, they're talking about that it's a horror, and um, Multiverse of Madness reminds me a lot of um, Lovecraft's Mountains of Madness. And about cults and other portals and dimensions. So I wonder if that's kind of where it's like a nod to that. Oh, the other thing is too. Yeah, uh, Wanda is going to be with him in this movie. Yeah, I saw that too. So So, I'm a little confused because it says spring for both Loki and Wanda. I wonder. I'm thinking the better possibility is Wanda is going to be with Doctor Strange, and from there it's going to bring off break off to the Wanda Vision. Okay. Somehow, I think that makes okay. the more of a sense. That you know, does it says spring, so I don't, because I don't think they have an actual date for it yet. So uh, this multiverse thing, I mean, Wanda is the one who is capable of of producing alternate realities. Whoa, whoa, whoa! In comics, so yes. MCU, she's just really powerful. She's just, and and what is her power, right? She, her it's power red is red mist, levitation. No, no, no. Her power comes blasts. from red mist. He blasts. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> she was created, right? She's not a mutant. Sort of, well, the thing yes. is, cause, yeah, yeah, yeah cause cause her and her brother she's were not like a mutant. On or whatever. Um, because they didn't have the rights correct. and they could not use that. So correct. they had, yeah. So her powers were given to her correct. by fucking uh, Baron Von Strucker, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And he did it using. Was it Loki's the, the staff. Tesseract? Or lo- okay, so Loki's staff had which stone? Uh, the Tesseract. Tesseract, yeah. the Mind Stone, the, or was Tesseract, because it? it's the blue one. But yeah, that's, isn't that the Mind one? No, when no. he was he was the touching, Mind one is no, the, the Tesseract's portals. Oh okay. The Mind Stone oh, is the one that's inside Vision's forehead. Yeah. Okay, because I just remember him touching people and being able to take over them. So. I was thinking he could do multiple things with it. I mm. guess. Well, whichever one was in there, that's the stone that was used to give her her powers. So her powers come from an Infinity Stone. So she's like an artificial Infinity Stone magic user. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But also in comics in the beginning, she wasn't able to alter alter reality. It wasn't until later in comics when they that started they doing House of M power. and stuff yeah. that she Where started. she got her Could power Could we get then. into a House of M situation? That's what I'm saying. Um, like what if she opens up alternate realities to multiverse if, madness? Though? If in the movie somehow Doctor Strange unlocks that in her, yeah, I could see that. So If he I, somehow... 
I'm excited for this, yeah. nonetheless. Dude, this, yeah. Dude. That one so, is one of my... Like I was saying, favorite. different dimensions, and it being horror, I, I can think of maybe him opening some cosmic portal to some fucking entity, and on the other side is just devouring things. Giant or, Cthulhu. Yeah. I think Cthulhu it's. I think something. it'll probably be like a, like their version of a Flashpoint, you know, where Flashpoint, you go into the universe where it's like... Batman's parents are actually the, you know, the Batman and the Joker and Bruce Wayne, so, you know. Like, yeah. They, so it could go into that kind of dark, It you could know, do, I mean, they could opposites. visit the, the Marvel zombie world. Marvel sure. zombie world. We can, I'm sure we'll get a reprisal. But role Fantastic of, Four is what you were saying. And fuck, man, that's what I've been saying is that's a way to introduce the Fantastic Four into this universe yeah. is to have them breach in through it's another the most dimension logical using way. Reed Richards. Yeah. And the whole negative zone and everything. Cause, yeah. Cause they can't be there already. Cause it's like, what are you doing the whole time? <laughs> and the mutants, they can't be there already in earth. They have to come in somehow. Or yeah. a way to do it would be Dr. Strange somehow at the end, <laughs> flying through doors, get stuck in the negative zone and then have Reed Richards fish him out as a fucking thing. And then boom, now you have them together. Yeah. Yeah, either way, it looks really, it sounds really exciting, I should say. Yeah. Then, I think out of all, so far, all of all that stuff, that's the one I'm most excited for. Summer of 2021. Same. This is okay. four things in 2021. Jesus. A very small amount of time. Uh, yeah, this is all in two years. Phase four is two years, which is kind of weird. Um, well, it's, a, it's a different type of phase they're doing. So, I mean, it's what, like three or four movies a, a year? Mm, no, dude. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There's seven things coming out in 2021. That's including so movies and four, Disney Plus. Three to four movies a year. <laughs> Dude, that's crazy. Uh, so then, summer of twenty twenty one is what if Disney Plus. Dude, oh, that yes, fuck yeah, dude. Was, Hell I, yeah. I was, I was definitely like, I was like, really? I was like, what yes. Do you do? When I saw that, what are they I was like, do? fuck. That just sounds like they can have fun with that, man. Yeah, I'm excited, fucking have fun with I'm excited that. for that. I'm excited for that. Yeah, too. Yes. it's just no barriers. No fucking. Go fucking have fun, dude. We could get. I mean, okay, that's how we're going to get Howard the Duck in there. That's how we're going to get fucking Gloop. That's how we're going to get all this crazy fucking shit, like, just to come out, And man. I think we could Galactus also get a reprisal. Also we could probably get a reprisal role of Chris Evans or I even Iron that. Man because, so, like, this is just a one-shot whatever dumb thing. Yeah, they could. Let's just bring you back just for fun. But that's, that's, yeah. It's a show, right? It's going to be Disney I Plus? I don't know. It's Disney Plus. I don't know. I, I, I don't remember because I remember hearing their movies, too. So I don't know which ones are movies oh or God, shows. If they make a what if movie, that would be that's what I thought it was fucking be. insane. I, I thought it was gonna be a show. I thought it was gonna be like a what if but show. But it's Disney just Plus for have, sure. Yeah. Like a bunch of just what if this happened like, and what if that happened. So that sounds fun. That's exciting. Yeah. Either or, man. I'm excited for a fucking what if anything. Dude. That would yeah. be fun for them. To have and fun. it's cool because they can do this now. We've had t- ten years of Marvel movies. Now the yeah. audience who's trained. In the Marvel movies, can see this and have fun along with us. Yeah, you know the way we did when the we way with comics. Comics. Yeah. comics did it much farther down the line oh, as okay. well. Uh, fall of 2021 is another Disney Plus is Hawkeye. The show, right? That's uh, Hawkeye's know. daughter. I don't know. I'm pretty sure that was a show, and that's going to be about Hawkeye's daughter. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Yeah. And okay. Um, yeah. Okay. Could be cool. Yeah, because it has plays, her. It has her symbol. She plays a female. Hawkeye okay. Or yeah, it has her symbol in it. So uh, Jeremy Renner survived, right? No. Yes. He survived Endgame. Yes. Right? Did he? Yes. Yeah. Uh, well, Scarlet died. So. Yes. Uh, so I, I bet you maybe he comes out in that. Maybe he's teaching her, right, or something like that. Maybe. Uh, like, uh, maybe uh, like a one episode cameo. Well, the way his s- his contract. The didn't way end. Samuel Jackson did with the uh, Agents of Shield. It's like you just do the one time, and that's all you got to do it. Uh, now maybe. it gives the show legitimacy. I just I feel like there would be more Jeremy Renner in that than you think because it's got to be him training her. To, I just to feel ready. like he's probably not beholden to that because he's got to look out for himself and do other movies and shit. Well, right now, as of right now, we knew Hawkeye as Jeremy Renner. Right. There's that he has not passed down the torch to her yet. Right. So I think this show. But is they could be... just do a. I'm blah blah blah, and I am Hawkeye's daughter. And <laughs> no, now I am over the here. The CW. Yeah. No. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's how you're gonna be watching too many fucking CW that, that's shows. Say, they that's could do not it. how it's gonna. They play. can do it. No. They oh, can do it. No, don't want that. I do they not want do that. They can do it. I am Hawkeye's daughter, and I practice every day, and I train so and hard. I, and she's just. And I am the sharpest shooter in the world. <laughs> The deadliest woman ever. <laughs> Hawkeye. Like my puppy. Yeah, man. 
<laughs> no wonder those shows are fucking shitty. I doubt they're going to fucking pay Jeremy Renner every fucking episode. Hey, man, you, you just got to come this and is, give her a little this fucking, is fucking pep talk. You're, we already said, it's give Marvel Studios, it's Disney money. Yeah, it's, it's, it's Disney good. money, but Jeremy Renner fucking still has to agree to it. Well, he also has to, like, his character in the MCU has he, to also it, pass he the has, torch. Look, dude, he's got no obligations to you, okay? <laughs> To fucking uh, he's got entertain a fucking you in any way. Did you read that contract? <laughs> I was like, I don't Do you know. know that I don't contract? Know contract All I know is. is that the people who died, their contracts were done. Okay. Okay. That was Evans. Uh-huh. That was fucking Stark. That was Johansson. Okay. They were like, we're done after All Endgame, right? right? So Johansson's coming back. True. Stupid bitch. <laughs> there goes your fucking <laughs> argument, you dumb fucking dumbass. <laughs> Fucking idiot. I hold all the power. Just edit all this out. No, keep it in there. Keep it in there. Parker. You know what I mean? Like, he's. he's You know what I mean? (laughs) If they were going to change him out, they got to do that handoff. They got to hand it off. I mean, that's your wishful thinking, man. I don't know his contract. I don't don't, don't think they have to do that. I think they're going to. I don't think they have to. You think there's going to be CW shows just I like, think they, just, I'm this character. I think they're going to be like, should we make Frank happy? Or should we just save ourselves a it fuck says, ton of it money? It says Hawkeye, not new Hawkeye, motherfucker. It's just, Who do we know Hawkeye is right now? I don't know, man. Jeremy fucking Renner. Jeremy Renner's Hawkeye right but now. It has her symbol in the title. It has her symbol. Because that purple dot is, is her... That's her you dumb that's her motherfucker. Because <laughs> he's training her. Right. She's going to be the new husband. Well, I think it could go either way. I'm in the middle. Literally. Right. I'm in the middle of this. Uh, last thing. November 5th, 2021. <laughs> Thor, Love and Thunder. Fuck. Yeah. yeah. You know what? Taika Waititi okay, coming I back to direct. Back. I'm most excited for this over. Yeah, um, Taika Waititi is coming back. Uh, uh, no, nah, man. Strange, I'm so. still over strange over this. I mean, yes, <laughs> I'm excited for Lady Thor. Yes, I'm excited for fucking... Uh, um, Natalie, Natalie Portman, Portman becoming she's, Thor. That I'm glad she's coming awesome. back. That's gonna be awesome, dude. That's awesome. I, I, that's I, another run yes. that I have all of the comics for. That uh, Lady Thor that run. Lady I have Thor? all of that nice. whole run. I hope they do it like the comics. I don't want to sound like like most people are like do it like the comics, but only because in the comics, see, this could be another multiverse thing because in the she's comics, she's got cancer. She's right? got cancer, and every time she uses the Thor, it kind of takes some of her life force life force away and doesn't HP. help it just kind of yeah it takes some of her hp away <laughs> and so she's basically literally giving her life to help others in a sense yeah and she's slowly dying but still you know transforming back into thor if they go with that storyline that would be super cool and that'd that would be, be really great cool. um i think they should do that i think that'd be great and um, I, that's why and then it ends with her dying yeah and then thor Comes picks back. the hammer back up and then he loses the weight you think he'll stuff the weight? I think he got to already be done with it, man. Yeah. I want also, to see more fat. He left though. with the Guardians, so I'm just I'm surprised. Like I was like, I thought they were gonna do a Guardians That's movie, true. and he's gonna be in it or something. Yeah, I don't know. Well, Tessa Thompson's coming back for sure. So it kind of, I don't know, it's kind of oh, weird post in game because you thought they were all going their separate paths. Oh, wow. You don't like her? No. I like her. Annoying. I liked her. I thought she was no. cool. No. No. You didn't like her either. Yeah, man. She, I mean, in Ragnarok, I did no. not like her in Ragnarok. She, wasn't, she no. wasn't charming. Nothing. She wasn't funny. I didn't. She wasn't likable. She, she wasn't maybe likable. Maybe it's just because I like diversity. You ever think of that? I like diversity <laughs> among the peoples of the world. Notice the things I said had nothing to do with her skin color. I mean, <laughs> and being just... a woman too. She's a woman. Okay. Oh, she's a woman. You don't want she women just... in the in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Okay, she did not pull off Valkyrie good. She didn't. She didn't pull I, off a good I have, Valkyrie. Uh, I have no prior knowledge to a Valkyrie, so didn't bother so me. So she didn't do Valkyrie good, and then she her acting and performance in Thor Ragnarok was was shit. She I mean she was what drunk half of the time, right? So she had to act drunk, which yeah. didn't really I didn't really buy it. She she just looked stupid. She looked I, like I, she looked like a dumb teenage girl trying to act drunk. Yeah. I well, I didn't buy it. I was cool with it. I was fine with it. Didn't buy. It. I, I, give me someone else who can act drunk. At least, I'll buy that. Tessa Thompson. Gets she can a, be whatever color. Down from the low-fi. She can be whatever color she wants. Up. I was joking about the director. I'm just I saying. Literally kill us. 
Uh, but I did like her. Yeah. No, uh, I'm a Marvel shill. Act so. better, bitch. Act better. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> just saying. Just saying. Uh, uh-huh. That's the last thing. That's, that's two cool. years. See, that, the that's, next two years. That's the next two years. It's a weird slate because the last sl- Phase three was like five, six years. You're like, dang. Because they spaced it out, too. <laughs> oh, no, no. Uh, so, yeah. See, that's fear, baby. <laughs> Take notes. I'm just kidding. Uh, so, that's the end of phase four. Uh, but officially, Blade is coming. Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh, and I'm, I'm excited for him. I don't know if you all saw my snap last night, but I sent a funny snap. I did. Because I was watching Alita, and he, he plays like one of the, the antagonists there. And you just you look at him the way he's dressed. He has this very square black and it, like the circle shades. And you're like, dude, like he cool already looks like, like, like a blade. Like yeah. he already looks like blade. Like yeah. it's, it's awesome. Yeah, yeah. I'm excited for Blade. Yeah. That, that, I, I hope that's a show, man. It's a movie, dude. I hope they make it into a show too. It's gonna be Disney movie, Plus. Though. I would love to see a fucking Blade show. Do you think since cool. Marvel and Sony are kind of kind Playing of uh, nice? are kind of playing nice, especially with their Spider-Verse, Spider-Man universe. Uh, since they are making a Morbius movie, for sure, Sony is, do you think they're going to cross over Blade and Morbius? Um, Maybe. Because that's they, officially I mean, happening. with Spider-Man, right? Uh, Mar- Morbius with I, Jared Leto is officially happening. Okay. So, I see. I don't I think. See, I see just, it's, a, it's a far doing, off. I, I see him doing the same shit with Joker, where he just does, he's going to do Morbius one thing. time, and then he's just going to fuck off. Interesting. This is my favorite Joker. <laughs> I honestly, I believe you. <laughs> no, no. I believe you. It's not true. You okay, It's not true. I'm, I'm, I'm glad you brought all this news to us. Because... I'm not done. Oh, okay. With There's the more. News, okay. All right. We'll see. Because yeah. also, it was confirmed. You know, Phase Five for sure. Kevin Feige confirmed. Yes, there's going to be a Captain Marvel two. Siege. So excited. <laughs> Captain Marvel two. It's official. Uh, Black Panther 2 is official. Black yeah. Panther 2. Fantastic 4 is officially coming. That's that was, that was official. Official? official. Official. He, not they, not yeah. like... Well, he they, said they it's Fantastic yes. 4. He, he said... Fantastic 4 we don't have, he basically no, no, no. He later. said it was, it was too... It was too soon to talk about any yeah. mutants. Yeah, well, he they, said they, Fantastic they, Four that's mutants. That's his we don't quote. Have to I'm talk quoting him. him. Yeah. He said, we don't have time to talk about all that right I read now. But, article where they but Fantastic Four it. was fucking confirmed, dude. Also, the article I read kept referring to them as the mutants. Fucking. So, Fantastic saying. Four? Dude. Fantastic Four and the mutants oh, is what they said. Yeah, I guess he didn't clearly say X-Men, but yeah. I mean, obviously. Yeah, yeah. They have the rights to Maybe they're coming. So, they're coming. probably coming Phase 5, I assume. <laughs> <laughs> <Into phase five. laughs> uh, well, I think there was another two that was coming out. Yeah. Oh, Guardians Three is also probably Guardians Phase Five. 3. Yeah. Uh, so those for sure. Well, are we knew come. that, right? Because Thor is going to come out in that one, right? I don't know, because James Gunn had already written that script like two years ago. So I don't know. You know what I like about I this it. about it. this phase is that it's it's giving a pretty good break for like a lot of the like you know the the Guardians. Anyone maybe who was uh, no Spider Man either. Yeah, that's the other true. weird thing. Uh, maybe well, I mean, we just five. got one. Yeah, I know, but those came left off on a really big like cliffhanger. Well, but, I mean, this it, it started. It. it st- I don't want Spider Man was the one who started all of the next after Endgame shit. No, it because it was phase, the movie after. But it, it ended Phase Three. You think? Right. Um, you think we get a Hulk movie? No, no. I don't <laughs> no. want a Hulk Damn. movie. Okay. No, they said his arm was permanently gimped. They ruined, they ruined him. They ruined him. He's not that smart. He's I, Bruce Banner. I agree. He's going to be the, the next. He's the only, <clears throat> the only thing with, that fucking guy's good at Tony, is gamma shit. With, hold on. With Tony gone and no Reed Richards yet, he's technically probably the biggest brain right now. Here's what they're no, going to do. No, Hank Pym. They're going to do Planet Thing. Is Hank Pym still alive? Yes. Okay. Yeah, they're going to do Planet Thing. Like the thing, but Planet Thing. What? Get it? Instead of instead of oh, doing instead Planet of Hulk, Hulk, you're gonna do Planet, Planet the thing. thing. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> makes just as much. I'd watch sense that. Because, uh, I'd, watch, I'd watch the thing. Fucking anyway. What I was saying was, time. what I like about this phase is that they're giving a lot of those big characters that we've known for the last three phases a little bit of a break, right? Uh, at least for this phase, and we'll probably get them coming back in phase five again or something like that. So it's like they're making room for like newer stuff. You know, and they're going to, I bet, because it's too soon, right? It's too soon to do another, oh, hey, we're going to do a fucking 
Another huge villain kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. Is what you're saying? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, like, I, I, a little yeah, bit of yeah I'm glad. I, I feel like they got to roll out. Yeah. So yeah. the first couple are probably not going to have. It might maybe uh, the way they did with, you know, um, Ultron and, well, not really Ultron, but with Thanos kind of. Build up, up a big it. villain? Very, it. very. But like be extremely Slowly. vague with. Yeah, yeah let, let this stuff breathe right now. Please right? be and doomed. And <laughs> I don't want them to do what they did in the first three phases, which is like every movie had to have an infinity stone or like mention an infinity stone it's like i get it there's infinity stones and like they, it's coming like i get it they like, all have every single mentions? movie every single one? like guardians well, had an infinity yeah, stone and they did they a backstory of infinity stones that's why all the movies were connected is because the infinity stones tied them but up i'm just saying the the teasers at the end they all talked about infinity stones most no, of them no but no maybe not all of them but but like they oh, all I know what you mean. mentioned, like that was the thing. That was the yeah. thing. I was like, I get it. Like the Infinity Stones are coming. Like I get it. Like Thanos is coming eventually, right? Yeah. When freaking Guardians had it. Age of Ultron needlessly had the Thor sequence where he's like in the water and it's like, mm-hmm. oh, there's five Infinity Stones. You're like, like I get it. Like all these kinds of things. Like it's just because mm-hmm. they got to teach the audience, man. They, they teach so, a little too much. So, I mean, a little too much. Some of the audience uh, <laughs> that's going to see this stuff is, uh, you know. <laughs> uh, you should just end it right there. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> just end the no, I, I, What I, I did want to say, Caleb, was I want to thank you for bringing us these headlines, man, because we were out on, on vacay. Sure. So we were in the middle of a boat in the middle of the ocean, so we had no internet. I was not. So I, was I, here, did, I did not get to see or hear Otherwise, any of this I'd stuff. I also have comic news, too. Yeah. But... No, you're good, man. You're good. Um, but, uh, but Kayla, we did bring you something what? from our travels, what? a little gift for you. What? Right. You want to see it? Is it a death whistle? It's... Is it that big balloon? Is this hat? Oh my gosh! This hat that says, wow. I love Cozumel. I love Cozumel. That's wow. where we went. This That's is, one of the places we went. This is perfect. Put it on, please. Wow, I will put this on right now. <laughs> this has nothing on this hat right here. <laughs> Fuck no, this bro. This bedazzled. There, there we go. That yeah. is, that is Hells got yeah. the sparkles yeah. and everything. That is perfect. <laughs> Just so yeah. perfect. You even got a rainbow right here too, right? Yeah, great, man. Yeah. Wow, that is, that is perfect. Ooh, okay, we're it's, good. it's got the little <laughs> torn, you know. Yeah, yeah, you got it. It's got the little yeah. frayed yeah. fray yeah. edges yeah. and stuff. Yeah, you know? wow. That's for you, man. Yeah. Yeah. I really you, man. appreciate it. I saw that hat you. and I was like, Kayla, that's for the right there, bro. You did. You got to get that Kayla <laughs> hat. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> well, thanks, guys. I appreciate it. This is a multi-purpose hat. Like, I can... Wear it for one. Yeah, yeah, also, yeah. if someone's trying to attack me, mm-hmm. what's up? Right. Slice right. them with It looks these good if you're just you know, going to run into the corner store or if you're, you corner know, store you're having or... dinner at... And, you know, if anyone Nancy ever Nancy. asks or ever has the question, it just says it right here. You know, I yeah. love cones of milk. I love cones of milk. I just love it. It's like, why do you love it? I just love it. Just love I don't it, know what else to say. I love it. Just read. Read it, okay? <laughs> I'm getting tired of telling everyone. <laughs> I had to put it on my hat. Oh, so I appreciate it, guys. You, Thank you, you so much. You got much. it, man. You I got it, bro. It. This, yeah. this is pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. I'm glad this is in the death whistle. This is way better. <laughs> way death better. Hat. Well, uh, that kind of does it for this episode, guys. Um, I wanted to get Caleb that hat and give it to him at the end because I, I knew he was going to take it home. I appreciate be proud it. wearing that stuff. Oh yeah, bring oh, it yeah. to work and everything. For sure, for sure. We'll see how it goes. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that's it for the end of this episode. Thanks for checking in with us. We'll be back. Uh, give you all of our latest thoughts and impressions on everything we've been thoughts watching and, and playing. Impressions. That's right, thoughts and impressions. Thoughts and impressions. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye. I Bye. love Consumel. Farewell. Farewell. Yeah, here we go. Real quick. Oh, just, love, just love it. Oh, I, love it. I love it. I love it. Right, right. I love Consumel. <laughs> <laughs>
You sack of Oi. shit. Oi, why don't you shut the...